Hi friends, welcome to Steam Saturday. Today we're gonna make Ooblick, which title comes from the Dr. Seuss book, Bartholomew and the Ooblick. The first thing you wanna do is put about half a cup of water in your bowl and then start adding your cornstarch. So when you're here from the library, you'll have gotten a cup of cornstarch and a little um, food coloring to make it colored. Now, the interesting thing about Ooblick is that it's a non-Newtonian solid, which means that sometimes, depending on, depending on, <laughs> um, how you treat it, it can be both a liquid and a solid. I think I should have added my um, cornstarch a little bit slower. So this oobleck right now is pretty much a solid. So I'm going to add a little bit more liquid until it becomes somewhere in between. And you could start out with a spoon, but you're gonna play with this with your hands anyway, so. Okay. There we go. So I think my oobleck is kind of about at the right consistency to start adding. dots and the food coloring is just for fun just to make it an interesting color and maybe a little bit more like the oobleck in the book right. <laughs> so you know you guys will have more fun with this than maybe watching me make it because you can see when I do lick it, lift it like that there we go, it's pretty much a liquid. But then when I, if I squeeze it, it becomes a solid. And then of course, when I let go, it becomes a liquid again. So you kind of can't see that. <laughs> but when you play with it, you'll see, boop. And if I see when I fling it against the side of the bowl, it's solid, and then it turns back into a liquid. So they say that if you make enough oobleck, you can actually walk across it. And if you put it next to uh, a speaker with a lot of bass, it'll move. So make your own oobleck, have fun, experiment, and then do a good job cleaning up. <laughs> have a great week. See you next team. Bye-bye.